Try to just, just freaking flex like, yeah. <laughs> How's this? Good night. Oh, come on. Wait. And we're off. Boom, done. Three, two, one. Where's my email? Where's my email? There's my email. There we go. And to celebrate. Oh, God. Shit. What's up, guys? Liam here. And welcome back to LSJTV. Shit. It's Alpha Loot review time. Hope you're doing good. Fuck. It is honestly so weird receiving packages right now. I mean, to be honest, even right now, I'm kind of doing this and thinking, mm, somebody that I don't know has touched that and I don't want to, in fact, I'm actually going to go and wash my hands. Okay, we're good. We're good, I actually threw the packaging away and I definitely recommend, it might sound OTT, it depends on what it's like in your friggin' country right now, but um, yeah, we're just being, being careful here, you know? So, we have four items picked up from this launch. They are all t-shirts, like so. We have one Performance Division T, two Performance Division T, three Performance Division T, and four Performance Cut-Off, okay? Um, if you guys are new here, I uh, love the Performance Tees. I have OG friggin' reviews of like the first ever one, like the third or fourth one or something like that from like 2017. First one was like 2015 or something stupid like that. Horrendous videos, so go and watch them if you fancy a laugh at the end of this. Welcome, if you are new, to my home gym. We have had a little bit of an expansion recently um, into this kind of side of the garage. It's now all matted and all that kind of stuff, so go and check out previous videos for that as well. And future videos coming tomorrow. It was gonna be live today, the day of filming this, but now this is going live. Anyway, you guys don't care about that. We're gonna get into the review. So, first up, we have the Mission Performance tee in grey. Um, I think it's like a... I picked up a light grey one and a dark grey one. The only reason that I actually managed to pick something up um, this time around was because I won a giveaway on G's page, GLJ. Um, she has a, a, a giveaway that she did and um, I, I won one. <laughs> so I had a 50 pound voucher. So basically two of these tees were, uh, were, were sorted, which is, which is nice. Before we get into shirt number one, numero uno, I'm around about five foot six, around about 172 0.2 pounds, which I was this morning, I think. Yeah, yeah, that's right. I have around about a 40 inch chest, I assume. I really should measure that. I'll probably do that in another video. Let me know if you would like me to film that video over the next few days, because I'm pumping them out at the minute. Anyway, that's my measurements. Let's get into the friggin' Alpha Lee review. The majority of you are here for that. The reason I picked up a few different tees is because the past few launches I've kind of focused on hoodies, I've focused on joggers and stuff like that. It's actually been a while since I picked up um, a couple of Alphalete tees and I do tend to go for, generally speaking, the more neutral kind of colours. Um, and so a lot of black, a lot of black on black, a lot of greys, dark greys, stuff like that. Um, I just tend to get drawn to that just kind of naturally. But then eventually we get a bright red thing and a bright purple thing and a 
bright green thing and it just you know I like the occasional thing but for the most most part I uh, I tend to go for the neutral colors so here is how the first one looks on me it is a medium like I say bear in mind my measurements Bosh I've no idea how big my arms are either doesn't actually ride up like anything like that this is what I used to do in, t in the old friggin reviews I would just stand there and be like uh, yeah so I really like this t-shirt um, and it's actually in a size medium as you guys can see it fits me really good around the arms and this is how it fits me like this. Honestly, seriously guys, if you fancy a laugh, just go and search for my old videos. <laughs> Fucking brilliant. Next up we have the dark grey one. Now there was an option of a black on black. And if you've been here for a while, you will know how I feel about black on black. Alpha Elite tea. I think I just mentioned it in fact, anyway. Um, so this one is actually a really dark grey. I'm actually wearing them with the identity joggers which are slightly faded now because I've worn them so much but that is testament to how sick they actually are if you ask me okay so here we are let me just put you down here actually I was gonna walk around for a bit but I, I shan't bother I don't know whether it's just me but this actually feels a little bit lighter than the other colors I said it in the last Alpha Lee video a couple months ago whenever it was the black tees or near to black tees just seem to fit ever so slightly different to the colored ones so we do actually have um, a kind of really bright one in a minute, okay? So, we'll see whether it's just me, whether I'm just being paranoid or whether my weight is fluctuating within the last five minutes of filming this clip. We shall see. There's actually two different designs, the performance tees within this launch. This is actually called the uh, retro launch or something like that, which I think is more tailored towards the women's side of stuff. But anyway, we have option number one where it says alpha lead across the chest like so in big bold writing and it actually says performance division. And option numero dos is the one that you just saw where it has the slogan, learn more, dream more, be more. Which one is better? You decide. It's also quite nice to actually be um, not fat in an Alphalete review with the last one that I did a couple months back. It was like February or January or something like that. And I felt woofy in it. I felt absolutely massive. Um, I was peak bulk and now I've lost like 12, 14 pounds and we're down to a kind of slightly more normal weight again. And I felt like, I felt like it paid off, you know? I felt like the bulk paid off, however, we were at that point of like 185, 186 pounds where I was just a bit like, okay, this, this is a bit too far. Here we have the third and final color of today's performance tea colors. And this is actually the parasailing color. Remember what I said a minute ago about wanting that quick burst of color. I've got the red stuff. I've got that yellow highlighter hoodie as well. That's one thing. There will be people that might potentially, probably, definitely a little bit annoyed that I didn't pick up a hoodie this time around. However, that is because the past two or three times I have picked up two or three hoodies. So I have multiple Alpha Elite hoodies, and I'm sure that you guys are the same and can relate, right? Right now, at this point in time, um, myself and the old man have been forced to stop working, and so my income is completely a zero. Let me know if you've heard that reference before. So right now, and I know a lot of you guys watching at home might be the same, I just have to be a little bit more careful with kind of where I spend my money. Do, do I need this? Do I need that? I mean, the chances are no, but am I still gonna buy it? Uh, the chances are yes. And thank you again to G, this is where that voucher comes in. I actually won a £50 voucher and there's around about £100 worth of stuff that you are seeing in this video. So I pretty much got everything half price this time around anyway. If that could happen every time, that would be awesome and I could bring you guys the sickest videos in the frigging world. Despite how I feel about the names, the fit, the colour, everything, I don't think I'll be wearing this colour whilst I'm training in the home gym. Um, I think I'll be wearing this to, to public gyms or to, I don't know, friggin' meetups or whatever. I don't, I don't know, I think I'll wear this outside of here purely because when you're filming stuff like this and you have very similar colors, it becomes very blending into one and you wanna pop on screen, on, on camera. Uh, how many new people are here and thinking I'm an absolute weirdo? Probably plenty is the answer to that. So we have the fourth and final item of today's video and that is a black performance cutoff. The reason I got it in black is because I actually have multiple colors um, of Alpha Elite's cutoffs already, uh, in particular white, I think I have a red one somewhere as well. And I actually wear um, vests a lot if, you, if you're new here or uh, if you've been here for a while you guys will know 
how often I actually wear a vest, in particular this kind of cut off type thing, right? I just, I like them, I like how they fit. And this is no exception. We just have the small Alphalete branding on the left chest this time around, people. What I feel like is different is where it actually cuts off. I feel like this bit here is thinner, which makes your shoulders look bigger. I feel like this here is not so low down, which means you don't have those nip slips all the time. If you ask me, it's been about 18 months since I last bought an Alpha Lee cut off, right? I've just kind of made do with the ones I have. I wish I bought more of these. I wish I only got one or two tees and maybe two or three of these instead, but hey, maybe next time. I'm sure there'll still be some in stock right now, but I probably shouldn't spend any more money on them. So just bear in mind all of my measurements. Here is how the medium fits on me like so. Bosh, bosh, bosh. I really like this, guys. I'm really happy with it. I was, I'll be honest, I was a little bit nervous about how this one was actually going to fit me, purely because my physique, I feel like, has changed a lot since I last bought an Alpha Leap cut off. Um, and obviously, the fit and everything was going to change. I was like, do I need a large? Do I need a small? And I was like, I don't actually know because, because of the whole COVID thing, right? No one really had um, males in particular, no one really had sizing videos up before it went up. I'm actually surprised as well that this package as like just in general arrived on Wednesday because there were delays of Alpha League getting them to their actual athletes, let alone to the public. And so if yours hasn't arrived yet, don't worry, it is coming. It's just a little bit delayed. Like this is the weirdest situation that the world has seen for the last like 100 years. So you're just gonna have to just bear with it for a, for a few minutes, maybe a few days, you know? So I hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. If you have, please do me a massive favor, drop it a like, drop a comment down below. Let me know what you picked up. Did you pick anything up? Did you not? Why, why not? Et cetera, et cetera. Let's get a conversation going in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching guys. Christian, I hope the launch went well. I know you probably, or someone that you know is gonna be watching this video. I hope it went well because of the whole Situation right now, lots of things are just not going as we expected. The main one on this channel being body power got delayed. Um, so, you know, stick with it, people. Stay positive, stay smiling. I hope you enjoyed the video. Like, comment, share, subscribe if you did. Thank you so much for watching. Together we will grow. And I will see you beautiful people in the next video. I'm off to take a thumbnail and some photos in this for actual Instagram. Try and get them live as quick as possible. Okay, cool. Right, I'll see you in a bit. Bye. Ooh, I thought it'd be me and you Flex like, yeah! <laughs> About a good old arms crossed kind of, how's this? Nah, the biceps won't work, you look like a twat.